About Family Justice What you need to know about applications for maintenance orders and enforcement orders. What is maintenance? Maintenance is a form of financial support. Under the Women's Charter, you can apply for maintenance of the wife, children and incapacitated husband. What maintenance orders can the court make? The court may order one party to pay maintenance for a wife and or a child or an incapacitated husband if he or she fails to do so. Examples of maintenance orders the court can make are a monthly allowance, a lump sum payment, repayment of specific expenses that are being paid by one party, and direct payment of expenses to a service provider like childcare centre and utilities providers. Who can apply for a maintenance order? You can apply for a maintenance order for yourself, from your spouse, if you are a wife or incapacitated husband, whose spouse has neglected and refused to provide you with reasonable maintenance. You can also apply for a maintenance order for yourself, from your parents, if you are 21 years old and above, and A. have mental or physical disability, B. are a full-time student or national serviceman, C are undergoing training for a trade, profession or vocation or D special circumstances exist. If a parent neglects or refuses to provide a child under 21 with reasonable maintenance, you as the other parent, guardian or adult sibling can apply for maintenance for the child. How does the court come to a judgment? The court would typically consider the following eight factors in making a maintenance order. The court will consider all circumstances of the case, including 1. The party's financial needs, 2. The party's income, earning capacity and other financial resources, 3. Whether the party has any physical or mental disability, 4. Age of each party to the marriage and the duration of the marriage, 5. The contributions made by each party to the family welfare, including looking after the home or caring for the family. 6. The standard of living enjoyed before the neglect or refusal. 7. The manner in which the child was being educated or trained. And 8. The conduct of each of the parties to the marriage. If the conduct is such that it would, in the opinion of the court, be inequitable to disregard it. What will the maintenance order state? A maintenance order will state the amount of maintenance to be paid, when it is to be paid, to whom it is to be paid, and the method of payment. A maintenance order must be obeyed unless and until it is rescinded, suspended, or varied. What if the other party fails to pay after an order has been issued? You can apply for enforcement of the maintenance order. If the other party fails to make one or more payments required under an order, the court may order the arrears to be enforced against him or her. Arrears refer to the outstanding amount of maintenance payable. No amount owing as maintenance shall be recoverable in any suit if it accrued due more than three years unless the court, under special circumstances, otherwise allows. You can file to enforce the following orders at the Family Justice Courts or FJC. Maintenance orders issued by FJC, Nafka Ida or Muta under a Sharia court order, and maintenance orders issued by the Tribunal for the Maintenance of Parents. Here are the various types of applications and how you can file them. Fresh maintenance orders for a spouse or child, enforcement of an existing maintenance order, enforcement of Nafka Ida or Muta under a Sharia court order, enforcement of tribunal for the maintenance of parents order, and variations, suspensions or rescissions of a maintenance or enforcement order made by the courts. What should you prepare when filing an application for a fresh maintenance order? Please note that this video does not cover fresh and variation maintenance applications under a Women's Charter Divorce Writ. Different processes apply for those applications and that is not covered here. Before filing an application for a fresh maintenance order, take note of the following four points. 1. Ascertain the period that your spouse or parent has neglected or refused to provide reasonable maintenance. 2. Calculate the maintenance you are requesting for. This can be done through working out an expenses sheet. 3. Settle on the type of maintenance you are requesting for. 
Are you requesting for a lump sum or monthly maintenance? 4. You should have your bank account details ready. If you are requesting for a bank transfer as the mode of payment, your application must also be supported by relevant documents. For instance, to file for maintenance from your spouse, you will need your identity card and marriage certificate. If you are an incapacitated husband applying for maintenance, you will need the requisite medical report. To file for maintenance from the parent of a child, you will need your identity card and the birth certificate of the child. If you are a legal guardian of the child, you will need to show the court orders issued to take care of the child. If you are 21 years old and above and applying for maintenance for yourself from your parents, you will need to prove that you 1. have mental or physical disability, 2. are a full-time student or national serviceman, 3. are undergoing training for a trade, profession or vocation, or 4. your special circumstances. What should you prepare before filing an application for an enforcement of an existing maintenance order? Before filing for an application for an enforcement order, you need to calculate the arrears. You will also need relevant documents like your identity card and court orders sought to be enforced. What should you prepare before filing for an application to vary, suspend or rescind a maintenance or enforcement order made by the court? If you are filing an application to suspend or rescind a maintenance or enforcement order made by the court, you need to ascertain the reason for variation or rescission. If you are filing an application to vary the maintenance amount, you need to calculate the new maintenance amount you are requesting for. To file for variation or rescission of a maintenance or enforcement order, you need relevant documents like your identity card and court orders sought to be varied or rescinded. How to make an application You can file the application online via iFAMS. For more information, please visit the FJC website.